What is going on guys? Jason Burke here, Styles Clash for Life, coming at you tonight with a huge Halloween haul. It's the first Halloween haul of the Halloween season. Happy Halloween season guys, I hope you're doing well. I went to uh, Joanne Fabrics, Walmart, and Spirit Halloween, which is now open in my area. Went to three stores today, got a whole bunch of stuff. I don't want this to be a super long video, so I'm going to kind of speed through some things, but this is one of the best hauls I ever got. Three stores, got something at each. Had a really good haul day. There's a lot of good authentic stuff in here I think you guys will enjoy. I'm sorry there's a fan in the background and my windows are open so it's kind of loud. I'm trying to drown out the background noise. But it's incredibly hot here in Pittsburgh tonight. Very sweaty. So if I start to pour, please don't think that I'm gross. I'm just hot. <laughs> but uh, I will show you guys real quick what I got. First off, I got one thing from Joanne Fabrics. It was like three bucks. It was on sale. It is a little uh, hand towel. You know you get excited about hand towels whenever you get older like myself. I'm now 30. <clears throat> but I got this awesome hand towel. It's an authentic trick-or-treat hand towel. You see the bats and the stars, the haunted house with the R.I.P. grave, and the trick-or-treat on the monogram. Nice orange Halloween color. I have no uh, Halloween style or scary style um, bath towels or anything like that, so it's my first hand towel that has Halloween theme. I love the authentic old-school design. I love, like, vintage Halloween stuff. Tony Rapino, I think, would appreciate this. Hopefully you're watching this, Tony. How's it going? So there's my Joanne Fabrics haul, my Halloween trick-or-treat hand towel. Then I, I went to, this This stuff now coming up is from Spirit Halloween. I got this $3 Jason magnet. It is a big size mask. Uh, there's a glare, sorry. There's a big size Jason magnet. His mask. I have a couple other Jason magnets like the vintage 8-bit one, but this one I had to get. It was 3 bucks. I love... Anything Jason Voorhees, as you can see by my Jason Voorhees shirt I'm wearing tonight. So, Jason Magnet, awesome stuff. I also got a Friday the 13th Jason Voorhees shot glass for a dollar. They have these little dollar shot glasses. I got the mask shot glass. It is my second ever horror shot glass besides my Walking Dead one. I love this, I'm going to use it all the time. I also got a Harley Quinn dollar shot glass. <clears throat> Suicide Squad Harley Quinn there with Daddy's little monster on the back. <clears throat> Margot Robbie and I are actually married. She just doesn't know it yet. Good seeing you, Miss Robbie. Also, I got a bunch of socks from there as well. I got some Toad Mario socks. They have $7 novelty socks there, and I love their socks. I got Walking Dead ones last time. This time I got some Toad. I love Mario. Huge Mario SNES fan. So I got the Toad Mario socks. Love those. I got the... Hakuna Matata, Lion King socks. You see the uh, picture of Simba there with Timon? Then you have the Hakuna Matata and the little print on the back. Love the Lion King. I think it's uh, Christina Bennett. Pixie Willows loves Lion King as well, if I'm not mistaken. Hopefully you're doing good, Christina. But I'm a huge Lion King fan, and I had to have these Lion King socks. And I also got some awesome Nightmare on Elm Street Freddy Krueger socks. I know all of you guys out there watching this love Freddy Krueger. It says, I heart Freddy Krueger. And the heart is actually Freddy's hat. And there's some print on the bottom as well, but I can't tell what it says yet. I'm going to open these up soon. But yes, Nightmare on Elm Street Freddy Krueger socks. $7. Also got Freddy Krueger, the striped beanie. This was like 12 or 13 bucks. I love beanies. I do wear a lot of hats in the winter. You guys haven't seen on my channel too much, but I love beanies. This is the Freddy sweater style beanie, and here you have the claws dragged in uh, Freddy's uh, claws scratched through the hat. I love this. I can't wait to wear this in the wintertime. So good to have authentic Freddy Krueger stuff. I also got more Jason Voorhees. I got Jason Voorhees mask ice cube tray. There's a little story on the back as well. I'm not going to read it for you guys. It's too long. But Jason Voorhees mask ice cube tray. I have aliens and I have some frogs, I think, for ice cube makers. But this is the best ice cube maker I have, and I will start using these right away to make some Jason ice cubes in case you want some murderous stuff, some drowning boy activity with your drinks. You can have Jason Voorhees. The detail on that's amazing, and this was, I think, eight bucks as well, but I had to have it. Also, I got a placemat. This is a... Uh, a dinner mat, a dinner placemat. It's gonna be hard to get it all in focus, but you have the bats, the haunted house. 
I'm trying to get it all in there. I don't know if I can. This was only like three or four bucks. Um, I'm not sure if I'm getting it all on camera, but you have the tree and the pumpkins and the bats and the house. It's another one of those authentic horror things. It just, the design looks so cool. It has the orange and all the haunting Halloween stuff. And I have no placemats for Halloween, so I'm going to use this on my actual uh, either kitchen table or dining room table. I can't wait to use this. <clears throat> then I got, I love this item. This is cool, too. I got a toilet, a toilet seat grabber. So you put this, here's a picture of what it's going to look like. You put this on your toilet seat, and it looks like blood on the toilet tank, and the actual seat has a, a zombie clown guy reaching out for you when you put the seat down. So I get to scare all my guests with a clown jumping out of the toilet seat at them. This is a really cool item, and it was like three bucks, so I had to pick it up. That's one of the most fun things that I have on this haul. I fixed my camera. Sorry. And then I went to Walmart and got some stuff as well. I got a trick-or-treat wall hanger sign. Once again, uh, very authentic, old school. I love stuff that feels like yard sale or old school authentic. I also love wall art. Anything wall art's cool. This is like a three-piece little uh, pumpkin with the trick-or-treat there for a few bucks. I think it was $3. So more stuff to hang on the walls for Halloween. I love that. I also got an, uh, a door plate or a uh, table placement thing here. It's like, uh, let's see, the Happy Halloween, you just put it on the table and it sits there. It's, it's like, like a little piece of uh, art sticking out. has the R.I.P., the bats, the ghosts, the pumpkins, the grave, Happy Halloween. I love this little sitting table piece. Really cool. Again, this was like three or four bucks. Put it on your dining room table or your end table or your kitchen counter, whatever. Something to put out. Also from Walmart, I got these two little bags. They're like tote bags. I'm going to use them for my groceries and also put them up on the wall possibly or something. Just little trick-or-treat bags. There's like bats and a moon and a, a mummy chasing a kid. These were like a buck. And here's some pumpkins. Again, these just feel like 90s old school Halloween, so they were a dollar. And I can use them for groceries when I go to Aldi's, so. It's practical, it's fun, and it's authentic. Also, something else for the wall. You guys saw last year I got a mask for the wall. This year, I have another mask for the wall, and it is a mask you'll recognize. It is one of Katie Tucker's favorites, Ghostface. Yes, I have this $7 Ghostface mask. Going to put this on the wall and actually leave it hanging up year-round. I got a dollar Halloween bandana. I like to wear bandanas once in a while. This has cats and owls and moons on it. It's orange. It was a buck. I like bandanas, so I'm going to wear that. I got two DVDs, $5.00. Last House on the Left, Collector's Edition. This is the original from 71. Uh, Wes Craven's first movie. I have it on VHS, and now I've got the Upgrade Special Edition on DVD with extras. $5. Love this movie. It's an all-time classic. I love Wes Craven. R.I.P. Wes. Also, I got another $5 DVD, triple feature. I, I own Pulp Fiction already, and I love and have seen Reservoir Dogs and Jackie Brown. All three are classics. Now I've got all three in a combo set on DVD. Love all these movies. If you guys have not seen a lot of Tarantino stuff, all three of these are must-watch movies. Very good stuff. And finally, I'm going to close with my, fa I think, my possibly favorite items. I, I like all this stuff, so it's hard to say. But I got four shirts from Walmart today. Four shirts. And uh, they, these are because of Katie Tucker. Katie Tucker posted um, on her Facebook that she found 750 uh, horror uh, novelty t-shirts at her Walmart. So I went out there hoping to find them, and uh, you will see what I found. But I, I got this one for five bucks. This is a uh, a guy. You see there, it's uh, I'm not good at uh, finding the camera lens. It's a very small camera. It is a picture of a um, what do you call him? The Grim Reaper with a six pack of beer, and it says, "Relax, I'm just here for the beer." So the Grim Reaper is coming, but he's not coming for your soul. He's coming for his six-pack of beer. I love that shirt. I'm a fan of October uh, craft beer and the Grim Reaper. The color was cool. It's Halloween-y. I like it. And Katie Tucker, once again, thank you for telling me about these t-shirts. I went out and found them. Um, I, I found three of the ones that you posted on your Facebook. I now own them for $7.50 apiece. So Katie, my friend, thank you very much. The first one is Nightmare on Elm Street. It is my buddy, Freddy Krueger. You see the claws there, the 
layout of Freddy in the Nightmare on Elm Street cover. I love this shirt. Seven fifty. Usually these shirts are twenty or twenty-five bucks online. Seven fifty. You can't beat them. I've got Katie's personal all-time favorite as well here. Since we're throwing shout-outs, I've got Michael Myers for seven fifty as well, and he's got the two knives, like the skull and crossbones. It is from Halloween Resurrection. Resurrection is one of the worst Halloweens, but so what? It's Michael Myers' mask and the skull and crossbones with the knives. Love Halloween. So I got that one, and I also got my buddy, Ghostface. The picture of Ghostface from Scream. Seven fifty here as well. So, all in all today, I think I probably spent about, like, 90 bucks, but I got magnets and a bunch of socks and some shot glasses, four different shirts, three pieces of wall art, a bandana. I got a ton of stuff here. There's, there's so much stuff here. So, uh, what did you guys think of the items? What was your favorite? And uh, what did you get in your hauls? Post your videos down below and tell me in the comments what you thought of this haul. So, until next time, guys, lock your doors, dim the lights, stay scared, and enjoy the movies. Happy Halloween season, my friends.